A day in the life of a Victorian chimney sweep was harsh and difficult. Chimney sweeping was a dirty and dangerous job, with children as young as four years old being employed as sweeps. They worked long hours, often starting their day before sunrise and finishing after sunset. Their working conditions were cramped and dark, and they were covered in soot and ash. The day would start with the sweep being sent up the chimney to clean it. This was a physically demanding task that required the sweep to climb up narrow flues and twist their bodies to clean every inch of the chimney. The soot was incredibly fine and would get everywhere, coating the sweep from head to toe and causing respiratory problems. After cleaning the chimney, the sweep would return to the ground, covered in soot, ash and possibly cuts and bruises from navigating the chimney's tight spaces. They would then clean their tools and themselves as best they could, using the only resource available to them, the River Thames. The rest of the day was spent traveling from one job to the next. The sweep would be expected to carry their equipment, including brushes and ropes, with them at all times. This was often a long and exhausting journey, as they had to navigate the busy streets of Victorian London, which was a dangerous place for a young child to be. Once they arrived at a new job, the process would start all over again. They would climb up the chimney, clean it and return to the ground, before moving on to the next job. This would continue until they had finished their rounds for the day. In the evenings, the sweeps would be given a place to sleep, usually in the attic of the master sweep's house. Conditions were cramped and often unsanitary, with many sweeps sleeping on the floor with no bedding. They were also expected to work on Sundays, with no days off. The life of a Victorian chimney sweep was incredibly difficult, with many of them dying young due to respiratory problems caused by inhaling soot. The long hours and dangerous working conditions made it a job to be avoided, and it was only after a campaign by the Society for the Prevention of Cruelty to Children that laws were passed to protect the young sweeps. The Chimney Sweepers and Chimneys Regulation Act was passed in 1875, making it illegal for children under the age of 9 to be employed as sweeps and for those between 9 and 16 to work more than 8 hours a day. In conclusion, a day in the life of a Victorian chimney sweep was a harsh and difficult experience, with the sweeps working long hours in cramped and dangerous conditions. Despite this, they were a necessary part of Victorian society, providing a vital service to keep people's homes warm and clean. The work of the sweeps was recognized as a problem, and eventually laws were passed to protect them and improve their working conditions.